All right, so with this one, we are looking at a circuit that's going to be connected in series and a circuit that's connected in parallel. So right now, we're calculating the total resistance. Again, we don't need to worry about the value of the battery, but the current flow is coming through here, and then it is going through both of these, and then both of these are connecting and then coming through to here. So we're going to treat this as a parallel circuit, and then we'll add resistor 1 and resistor 4. So for this, we want the resistance total is going to equal 1 over resistance 2 plus 1 over resistance 3. Now take note, these have the K next to the values, which means they're in the thousands. So for this, we are looking at a calculation of 1 over 100,000 plus 1 over 75,000. So we go ahead and we put that into our calculator. 1, we use that fraction symbol, over 100,000, arrow across, plus 1, fraction symbol, over 75,000, then that equaling 7 over 300, thousand and we want to flip that so that in our calculator we're going to write three hundred thousand over seven three hundred thousand and then we're pressing that fractions about fractions button over seven and then we want to press that sd button again that should look something like that so the double-sided arrow and that will turn our fraction into a decimal and then that's going to equal 42,857.14. So that's the first step. That's not the final answer because we still need to add in R1 and R4. So our calculation is actually going to be 42,000 under our calculator, 857. 0.14 plus 2,200 plus 400. So when we put that into our calculator, plus 2,200 plus 400, and then we want that as a fraction, as a decimal, sorry, not a fraction, that's going to equal 45,457. 0.14 ohms. So that is the answer we're looking at. We want to calculate that, which is a resistance in parallel circuit. And then we want to just simply add R1 and R4, giving us a total answer of 45,457.14 ohms.